Hey everyone, welcome back to Code of the Row. In this video, I'm going to be going over the low poly shooter pack by Infima Games. And you can get this on Gumroad for only $180. It's fully replicated, first person and third person. They come with AI, mannequin ready, uh, respawn, loadout system, more than 50 presets for weapons. And all their guns are animated, different types of weapon material on attachments that you can customize. And it is very easy to work with. And it does work with the latest version of Unreal. And as you can see, it has a glaring five-star reviews. So in their recent update, they added unarmed combat, more explosives. And this poly shooter pack comes with their, it's basically their entire bundle, which comes with animations, weapons, low poly weapons and characters and AI. And let me just go ahead and do a overview of this asset pack. So you can see, I started with the basic assault rifle. And when I click Y, I'll go into third person mode. And yeah, this actually just looks and feels really good. I can shoot these little targets to send them down. And they they have explosives with really nice effects. They even show some uh, certain visual effects here, like blood, metal, dirt, and concrete. And they have these little canisters that kind of just swirl around depending on where you shoot them and blows up. And you can see that there is some Niagara component blowing up certain building parts. And there is AI that I can take care of. If I shoot them and don't finish them off, they'll start shooting me. And when I spawn in, I can select quite a few types of guns. So for this one, I'll just use something like the rocket launcher and click spawn. And now let me just run through this really quickly. So you'll see that there are these stone walls that are fractured and stuff using Niagara components. So I can blow it up just like that and all these guys. And there are some destructible houses that the pack comes with as well. And again, this is all replicated. So other users will be seeing this too. This is by far the most fun out of the box pack that I've seen. It's also the most, probably the most game ready that I've seen as well. And they do come with multiple types of maps. So there are tons of different ones. So for example, let's go to the desert. So as you can see, there are hit marker sound effects as well when I shoot these targets. And when I go over to the war zone map, it's gonna be kind of like what you see in their cinematics and so on. And you can practice on these little targets again. And if you hold E, you can kind of tilt to the right. And holding Q will tilt you to the left. They also come with a main menu and so on. And I'll just put the map or I'll put the um I'll put the link to this asset pack in the description and comments below. So let's try this house defense map. So this is kind of like your zombies where enemies will come from different sides, and you can just have an endless AI spawner, just people coming in, trying to break in through buildings and so on. And they even showcase a cinematic. So they have this really cool cinematic that plays just to showcase you how things work. And you can even use this, use this asset pack as a very nice learner spot to kind of just see how things are done, how things are professionally made. And again, it's very optimized and replicated. I've been getting over 120 FPS on every single map and it comes with a really nice looking menu as well. So yeah, there's just a ton of things in this map or in this asset pack that it comes with. It looks really, really nice. I love how it already comes with a really nice looking UI. And yeah, for the price that you're getting for this, uh, definitely really high quality assets that would probably be really, really hard to find anywhere else because they do a lot of their work in Blender. And this team is just absolutely amazing. Uh, these graphics, these little details and so on uh, are just are just absolutely fantastic. And yeah, I would definitely recommend getting this if you're looking for some sort of replicated third or first person game. I am going to be using this or these mechanics at least into making like a horror shooter type game and you might have seen my videos on it or even some shorts i do use uh these assets quite a bit especially in cinematics and yeah thanks for watching code of the road like subscribe comment below what you want to see next and i'll see you in the next video this is an asset overview video for the low poly shooter pack by infima games